Mr. Bigley. Hey there, it's Gerbigli, and today I'm playing a game called Super Oliver World. In this, we're just a little guy named Oliver who's trying to make his way through a very hostile world. It's one of those 2D platformer style games. Very excited to play one. So let's go ahead, let's jump in and see what it's all about. Okay, so we have 15 different levels it looks like. Let's start with level one. I think that's the only one we can do. Oh, we got a little cutscene here. Oliver's being chased by a bunch of bumblebees. Oh my god, I would actually be very terrified as well, so I don't blame him. But he fell through the floor into a teleporter, so maybe not great for him. I don't know, we'll find out. Okay, so, just standard platformer controls, getting some coins. Ooh, we got breakable bricks, I like that. Got a heart, I don't know what that's gonna be, probably to absorb a hit of damage. We got little uh, guys that we get to mush by just bashing, jumping on top of. Boom, you're dead, you're dead. And I assume that I probably don't want to touch that thing, whatever was coming out of the uh, the pipe there. Got a star. Oh, okay, I see. So we have to, ooh, ooh, I did take a hit. Okay, so that, that heart kept me, I'm assuming, from dying. Oh my God, I'm doing flips and stuff? There's one of those bees that was chasing me. So you get for being mean, I'm gonna bash you in the head. Now, can we do this? Oh yeah, we can. All right, the old school mechanics of being able to bop a block that an enemy's standing on and knock him out. Okay. So those things are rough. Those are evil and mean. And it looks like it's the type of game that has three stars a level is what my guess is gonna be. Ooh, and there's a little switch, okay. Don't mind if I do. Bash another uh, little guy running around. Just jump on his head. I like this game so far. I like the uh, the music and the, uh, honestly, the graphics are really nice. Ooh, that was an extra life? Nice, okay, so we have six lives now. Pretty good. I don't see a timer or anything, which is also really nice. It means that uh, I'm going to be a little bit less stressed about getting to the end of a level that I'm not familiar with. Okay, so that guy gets bopped as well. Jump on that little bee, do a little stylized flip off of his head. Feels pretty good. Ooh, game's telling me to go down there. What if I ignore that and I go this way instead? I feel like I got to go in here. I got to try it. I got to at least check out what's down here. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, and it's the third star. I'm so glad that I I didn't decide to be a jerk and <laughs> ignore the pointing hand. I did decide to go back and get that last star. Nice. Okay, now go down this one. Where's it going to spit me out is the question. Oh, and the one right next to it. Okay, so I didn't really waste too much of my time at all. It was actually pretty good. Okay, and then I got to the teleporter. Does that mean I won the level? Level complete! All right, best uh, and new score, new best score, I should say. 2,917 points, three stars. Not too bad learning how to play the game. I like this a lot. It's very chill. Oh my gosh, Did that enemy just jump across the gap? Yep, okay, it can. What's this? I don't know, okay, J shoot. Oh, I got zappy zaps. And it didn't look like that enemy died from just the one zap, so. I'm assuming some of them are a little bit stronger. Yep, that guy takes two each time. Oh, hey, get out of my space, man. I got zappy zaps for you. I could zap you whenever and however I want if you keep up this nonsense. All right, Ooh, there we go. Can I zap these things? Yeah, I can, get down there. Stay in that, stay in that pipe where you belong, down in the yucky sewers, you weirdo. Okay. Zap that B. I like that it just watched me miss one time and it was like, well, I guess this is my fate. It's time to die to this fireball. All right, I like this. This is cool. Oh my gosh. Hey, you stay away from me. There we go. Bop that guy as well. Grab these coins. Very nice. Man, I'm really enjoying this game. This is a lot of fun. And now uh, I got another heart. So I, I'm assuming maybe I'll be able to absorb a hit. Ooh, and, okay, I got over 100 coins, so I got another life, so I'm up to seven lives. So I can mess up a lot, really, is the way that I look at that. <laughs> okay, what's in this one? The third star, of course. I will take it. I will gladly take it, honestly. Okay, I'm gonna bop you, because it's easier to jump on the bees than to shoot them, I feel like. All right, that guy... Not a chance in the world. And we're at the end of the level. Nice, we're cruising. Level two complete. Look at that new best score as we continue to go forward into level three. This game's fun. It's really, really fun. Now, I want to find out if I can jump on those guys that take two fireballs. Maybe they die after just one jump, in which case that will be a much more efficient way 
to take them out in the future. Okay, you're dead. You're dead. Give me your coins. Thank you. This mysterious paradise land that we are invading and then destroying all the denizens of. Boom. Okay, it is only one jump. Okay, nice. All right, well, something good to, to keep in mind for those moments I uh, don't have a great shot. All right. Grab another star. Just cruising through this. Oh, my gosh. Reminds me of so many of the games that I played growing up, so... I feel like I have a little bit of an advantage as far as being able to handle the mechanics of this game, but that makes me really happy. It means that I'm just having fun, chilling out, vibing. Very good stuff. All right. Now, I haven't tried to go down any more pipes, but I don't think that I can. What's this? Ooh! Oh, my God, the old invincibility star. Oh, yeah. And you can still bounce off of enemies, which is kind of helpful. And then, boom. Now, I don't know how long it lasts, so I should probably... Be careful about that part of it. But it's nice to know that I can just uh, shoot fireballs and kill enemies by running into them with that thing. That lasted for a long time, it felt like. I feel good about that, though. That's pretty cool. All right, more coins. More coins for me. Or I guess for Oliver. There we go. Three stars. Seven lives left. Oh, my gosh. Zero deaths so far. We're cruising. New world, it looks like. All right, level four has a different theme. What is this place? Oh my gosh, that guy looked like he had something on his head that maybe would have made him harder to harder to jump on and kill. And that little hermit crab guy that I just killed also was someone that I, uh, I don't know if I, I would be able to destroy him. Oh! Oh, I lost my fire! No! I thought that I could use the, uh, the principles of every platformer I've ever seen and... Okay, so I can jump on those guys. Oh, well, that's good to know at least. Um, I thought that I would be able to to hop on that bullet guy and instead what happened was I lost my firepower but that's okay because I'm still a pretty good jumper I gotta say I'm pretty good at mushing the heads of the bad guys so cannot take out those big uh, mean bullet guys which is fine that's totally understandable what about you can I jump on you Ooh, okay I see so you're like a little shell boy who disappears after X amount of time I guess after I throw you Okay, so I can bop him on his head and then throw him. Okay, so what do we got here? Oh, another heart? Okay, well, don't mind if I do. Nine lives now. So even if I make more mistakes like I did with the bullet, you know, it's not the biggest issue in the world, in my opinion. Now, did I miss anything this way? Nope, I did not. Again, it put me out with a pipe that was like right next to one that I was already standing on. Those are collapsible blocks. That doesn't seem good. All right. Ooh, and then we have the cannon shooting at us as well. Oh, my gosh. Perilous out here for Oliver. He's having a rough time. He's just trying to go about his day. Oh, my God. I missed a star. That's okay. That's okay. That's what future playthroughs are for. I will jump back. I will find that a different date, but I guess that gives you all the uh, the opportunity to go looking for it for yourself. So that's kind of good. All right, get out of there. And, oh, okay, so the enemies will fall down if you break one of the blocks that they're walking along. They will fall down into whatever area you bop them at. Oh my gosh, I was about to just take a leap of faith. I'm so glad I didn't. That would have been a loss of a life. That would have been bad. I gotta wait until those platforms are coming back. So come on back here. Give me something to jump on. Thank you. And I'll take all those coins gladly. And then you get bopped and then smacked into the bad guys. And then do you just go back and forth forever? Nope, eventually you poof, just like I thought. Okay, good to know. Oh my god, I almost just took another leap of faith. Would have been right into the waiting jaws of the evil plant monster. Okay, oop. All right, well, I want these coins, so I have to stand here and... Try to avoid those bullets. Didn't get very many coins. Thanks a lot, bullet guy. You jerk. Okay, this spitting plant is going to make my life a little difficult. The spike pit as well. But that's okay. Line it just right. There we go. There we go. Getting everything I need. Bam, bam. Can I jump on it again? I can. Oh, you get 200 bonus points if you you jump on the hermit crab shell after... Uh, after it's already going. That's kind of good to know. That's really cool, actually. With the bonus point multiplier. Three stars on this stage, so that's nice, at least. 
Very good. I don't know if there's any bosses in this game or anything. So far, it doesn't seem like there is, but maybe level 15 will have them. I guess, though, that's going to be something that you're going to have to find out yourself because I'm actually out of time with Super Oliver World. This game's really fun. I think it's well made. I love the variety of enemies and environments. I like that there's a lot of classic gameplay elements, so it's not hard to pick up and learn immediately. And it just, it's chill. It's a good game. It's got good music. It's got good pixel art. All of it's really fun. But hopefully you enjoyed watching me roam around bashing on the heads of a bunch of enemies. If you did, please, please, please check this game out over here on lag.com. And as always, it was great seeing ya. Bye bye